quite a bit different because at the moment my husband is using the good camera and lights and microphone to film his own video. I currently have my iPhone attached to some sort of springy device that holds it. Today when I woke up I decided that I was going to tune eight ukuleles and I actually hadn't planned to film it but then as I was getting all of them out I thought maybe this would be fun to watch. If you're wondering why I have eight ukuleles to tune, I recently did a giant unboxing of ukuleles and guitars and other music gear, and my goal is to incorporate these eight ukuleles into review videos. However, before I can review them, I need to hear how they sound when they're in tune. For some ukuleles, it can take a few days or even a few weeks to get to the point where you can tune it and it won't fall out of tune soon after. I will be using my trusty Snark clip-on tuner and tells you if it's in tune or super out of tune, like this. One down, seven to go. Time to tune the ADM ukulele. This is so fun. <laughs> I get so surprised every time I hear how low the string is. It's interesting, this one like gets stuck on F sharp for a long time before it moves past it. That one's already pretty out of tune. That's actually probably pretty normal, but it's possible that this one, the Oscar Schmidt, is just a bit higher quality and that's why it's staying in tune better. Actually, I'm curious after sitting for five minutes, how it sounds. Wow, that's really impressive. All right, let's try this Oh Hoo Hoo ukulele. That's the name of the brand, but it's Uke. <laughs> Sounds pretty good after one tune. All right, time to try the cloud music ukulele. Amazing candy case. <laughs> Okay, let's go through all of them again before I tune any more just to hear how they sound after like five, ten minutes of not being touched. Oscar Schmidt. Still sounds great. ADM. Oh hoo hoo. I thought it'd be interesting to hear how all of them sound after having a 15 minute break. I would expect for all of them to sound pretty out of tune, but let's just hear a little comparison. Starting with the Oscar Schmidt, I will play the same 
chord progression on all of them so we can hear a fair comparison. I'd give that about a 9 out of 10 for how in tune it sounds after only being tuned once. Now the ADM. I'm not putting down ADM or this ukulele because like I said, you do have to give ukuleles a fair chance of like a several days to several weeks before you judge how well it stays in tune. I still have hope in this one, but as far as how it sounds after one tuning, I'm gonna give it like a two out of ten. Now for the oh hoo hoo. I'm gonna give that like a six out of ten. This is the ranch. slightly more in tune than the Ohuhu, so I'll give it a 7 out of 10. Now for the cloud music ukulele. I think that sounds just about as in tune as the ranch ukulele, so I'll give this a 7 out of 10 too. Now for the pink Ola. around where the ADM was, so I'm going to give it a 2 out of 10. Let's hear how the Donner sounds. I'd give that about a 5 out of 10. And last but not least, we have the Zebra Ola. I'm now going to tune all of these ukuleles again, and then probably again, and then again for the next few days until I make review videos. So for now, I'll go ahead and say goodbye, but if you would like to check out the ratings or reviews, prices on all these ukuleles, I will link them in the description box down below. And until next time, remember to play right and spread the light.